Today we're going to take a look at 1 Peter chapter 4. And as you're thinking about this chapter, as you're kind of using it as a start of your day or devotional, think about three things that are focused on in this chapter. One is the amazing blessing of being cleansed from our sins by Jesus Christ and how he suffered that we might be pure and clean. The other thing is that Peter focuses on being faithful in prayer being cleansed from sin, being faithful in prayer. And then there's one more that he focuses on that's very important. Listen to this. He says, don't be ashamed to suffer for the sake of Jesus Christ because Jesus suffered for you. Listen to these verses. I'll read it to you from 1 Peter chapter 4. It begins in verse 12. Beloved, don't think it's strange concerning the fiery trial which is to try you. Don't think it's weird or crazy that you're going to go through difficulties. He says, as though some strange thing has happened to you. But rejoice to the extent that you partake in the sufferings of Christ, that when his glory is revealed, you may also be glad with exceeding joy. If you're reproached for the name of Christ, he says, blessed are you, for the spirit of glory and of God rests upon you. On their part, he is blasphemed but on your part, he is glorified. So three things I want you to remember to think about today as you walk out your day. Number one, we've been cleansed of our sins because of Christ's suffering. Number two, stay faithful in prayer. It's one thing I heard this somewhere. It's one thing to talk about God. It's another thing to talk to God. It's about relationship. And the third thing, don't think it's strange when you go through difficulties. Christ suffered will suffer for his sake, and it's a glorious thing to partake together in the sufferings of Christ. Those three things, chapter 4, 1 Peter, think of those today and kind of talk to the Lord as you're faithful in prayer.